guys, so for the next week, I'm going to be spending a lot of time with my in-laws. We're heading up to the Bay Area and we are basically just road tripping up there. So we've been on the road for about five hours now. We did stop by a gas station to use the bathroom. We also picked up some coffee. And now we are going to finally eat our late lunch. I'm pretty excited because I have been looking forward to this for a while now. I've been to Splash Cafe before, probably about two years ago. And I love the pound chowder. So I'm pretty excited to get some pound chowder again, as well as some other seafood. As you can see, there are a decent amount of people out and about. Ichiro. Hey, boy, boy. mother-in-law and my father-in-law. Say hi guys. <laughs> These are our drinks that we brought with us on the road. Jim, Look at this dog. We throw it down. Jim, the bobs are totally rolled out of it. You know there's hella. Here we go guys. Mm. Mm. Tastes a little different. It's still good. Alright guys, now we're gonna try some of this. Now that there's no more soup plantation, I feel like I haven't had cum chowder in forever. Just hitting the spot, guys. and take a break before we go out and pick up a few of the items that we need. But yeah, this is a pretty nice spot. We are at La Quinta Inn here in Paso Robles. I've stayed here before actually, a few years ago. And I remember this being very pet friendly. So we knew, at least I knew, that this would be a great spot for us to stay since we brought each other with us on this trip. So, so I'm excited to be here. Of course, I'm still a little nervous, still very cautious about social distancing and everything, but this is probably the most traveling I've done all year long. So every time I travel and check in at a hotel, I always hit up the gym, like always. That's like my norm. And well, the gym's closed, so I'm bummed, but what can I do, right? 
All right, so before we head out again, I wanted to share again about our food, my food experience earlier, which is after finishing the whole lobster roll, I realized how much imitation crab was in it and well, not really my thing. I mean, I enjoyed it because I was hungry and I love seafood, but if I'm gonna eat a lobster roll, I want a lobster roll full of just lobster. That's my personal preference, so. Letting you guys know if you're the same as me and you prefer the buttery full-on lobster, that is not what you're gonna get from Splash Cafe. Um, I definitely would recommend going there though. Their, their clam chowder is amazing and well, everything else on the menu looks amazing. I have yet to try it, but definitely go there for their clam chowder. All right guys, so it is day two on the road, on our way to Half Moon Bay, and we are here in Santa Cruz right now, actually. Yesterday, after we completed our Target run, we just picked up some fast food and head back to the hotel and just chill, just relax. It was already too dark for me and I was too tired to go wander the streets at night. So, yeah, we're here eating some barbecue in Santa Cruz for the hubby's birthday, guys. <laughs> birthday lunch here in santa cruz and then we're gonna make our way to half moon bay just hopefully another two hours and we're good to go shall see you once we get our orders in front of us let's eat Bird. Bird. Yes. Chicken. 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 Mm. Chicken time for me. Just eat it easier, please. Here. I got my hands tossed up. Here we go. Mm. Super soft, it melts right off. Melts right off. Some people might mistake this for mashed potatoes. But you'd be mistaken. Because it's actually ice cream. That's true, it looks like mashed potatoes. Now you're about to witness the glory of ice cream on Gary Hot. All right, birthday boy is going to try the first bite. Happy birthday to me. Blammo. Oh my god, look at that ooze. Look at that. You know it's going to be good. Do you see that? It's oozing. It is oozing. take a bit of ice cream. Take this scoop. Oh, you guys see this. Oh my god, that good? Am I gonna do my little dance like I was in Julian? There's when I was so in... much going on right now. Oh my god, all right. The, the heat, I can't the wait to warmest, try it. The gooeyness, the sweetness, the crunchiness of the crust, the ice cream. You beat this with a stick. Mm. What the heck? He just slurped. I know, is that good? That was weird. Alright, scoop of the ice cream. Oh, it's melting already. Look mm -hmm. at that. The ice cream just like sunk right in. Yep. Oh my goodness. Berry it's cobbler. not pretty anymore. It's okay. Here we go. Oh, it smells so very delicious. Okay. I felt like one bite wasn't enough. It's not. Hmm. Look at that. Look at that. Oh man. What a what a good proportion of ice cream and pie at the same time. Oh that's see, you slurp too. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I heard it. You know, it's weird. Usually when I love something, I take one bite, I close my eyes, and I just... But this one is, I think because it's so warm, I wanted to keep going at it. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Alright, man. Before I eat all this, yeah. I think they need to try some more. Yeah. Well, at least we're one of us. Mom, ready? To Half Moon Bay, and we're here with our relatives. Charles greeted us. Hey, cuz. Hey, cuz. <laughs> and uh, of course, this our guy's ready to go. ready to go, go exercise, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have to unload our stuff before we can hang out. So, thanks for joining me on this road trip from Mecca, California, all the way to Half Moon Bay. Be sure to check out my next video, guys. But before then, be sure to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!